This time on BBO, we're going to log in and create a table for some friends of ours to play. Uh, this is an easy, a set game is a good way of playing against your friends and it's fairly easy to set up. So we'll log into BBO and again we'll go to the casual plan and we'll choose the relaxed bridge club and we'll start a table here. So as always, I require people to give, I want to give permission for people to play at my table. As I said in the previous video, this is mainly because if one of my friends drops off, other people cannot jump into their seat and then I have the embarrassment of asking them to leave because my friend will be back in a couple of minutes. Uh, you'll be able to stop people doing that. So I'm going to reserve seats for myself, Paul G, and my brother Alex, who's Gibson A, and West, we're going to let Penny be there. We can get her name right. And East is going to be Jean Mole. Molly one these days. When I start the table, they invite these people to play. And we'll do that. I was sitting north. I get messages on the right hand side saying they're not logged in or available. When they do log in, they will get a message saying, a seat is reserved for you at Paul G's table. Do you want to go there? And this is, this is an easy way of getting them to join the table. The other thing I tend to do for set games is to change the deal source. Uh, and I'll use randomly selected view graph deals. The reason for this is that view graph deals have two comparisons, whereas if you play random deals, they'll typically have 16. But the difference is that they'll be played by better players because only typically better players are on view graph. So you get two sensible results or reasonably sensible results instead of the whole gamut of results that you can get from the BBO general public. As an example, if you bid a game in a view graph match and it's a normal game, then you'll probably score zero imps. Uh, it'll be flat because everybody has bid it. But if you bid any game in a random set of boards, you'll win at least two imps because some people, you've got beginners playing and everything. Uh, so you just get some people who have silly results. So that's about it. Thanks.